So after many, many hours of cutting and sanding and trimming, we've had all our sides, got all our bits ready for our bird boxes. So they're gonna to start to assemble. So we are finished now of our scrap pallet wood um, bird boxes. We did two um, with a 28 mil hole in, and then we've done three with a 38, 32 mil hole. Sorry, because apparently different type of birds you need a different size hole. And then we've done two open front ones for fly catchers and robins. Um, I put a piece of EDPM rubber on the top of the joints. This one and this one, the roofs are fixed down because obviously you've got the open front. Um, but the rest of them with the hole in, I've used the rubber as like a hinge and just put one screw in to um, hold the top down because obviously they've got to be cleaned out at the every, end of every year. So, so yeah, I'm really pleased with those. Um, like I said, all along, we cut the uh, pallets down, sanded them down and I stuck them to a piece of 5mm ply because obviously the slats weren't big enough so it gave me like a bit of a board and then we've just cut all the parts of uh, the bits we had and to be honest for some rubbish pallets that was chucked about in the bottom of the garden they've turned out really really I'm really pleased with them so they will be going to my wife's school on Friday so they can put them in their wild garden ready for the birds to nest in them. I think, I don't know if it's too early or too late this year, but um, obviously they'll be able to do what they want to do with them and get them up and then the birds can use them. So as I say, I'm really happy with those. So anyway guys, hope you've enjoyed the project. Uh, thanks for checking out and uh, be safe, take care, and I'll speak to you soon. Bye for now.